All right, so uh, this is a picture of a dendromer, which is a molecule that was discovered in the late 70s, and through the 1980s, people started to learn how to uh, manipulate them. And it's called a dendromer because it looks kind of like tree branches, and this is part of chemical formula. And what's neat about this thing, and why it's nano, is because as the number of branches increase, its uh, shape starts to change, which affects how it reacts with things. And you can think of it like a sponge, except that uh, an analogy would be that as the sponge changes size, the amount of water that it would soak up would change. Um, or perhaps it would start to soak up something like honey or oily. And um, so the idea behind these fractal molecules is they're like artificial proteins and you can engineer them to clean up chemical spills is the hope. So by using just a few, say, million of these, uh, you could clean up an oil spill as opposed to using many, many, many trillions of some other chemical. So it's both green and nano and could help the environment.